Hello and welcome back to Fallen Enchantress Part 2. I completely forgot about this game because a friend of mine just introduced me to World of Tanks. I've been playing that non-stop and now it's clogging up my hard drive. So now I'm playing this game back again after I managed to clear some of it out. I'm going to try and do a upload a new video every other day. But anyway, without further ado, let's get back to Fallen Enchantress. I'll just try and remember what I'm doing for one thing. And it looks like I've just loaded at the end of a turn. I've literally just loaded. I haven't done anything since the last time. And I've realised I've got an empty essence right there. Let's fill it with mana. Now, see what's going on. Oh, new research. Let's get some trading. Want those roads in between the towns. Let's get exploring. Oh, I think I'll definitely need to build a town there as fast as possible to get as much iron as I can. It will be very useful to have a fort here as well. Syndicate. I, I cannot, def I cannot fight them at the moment. I'm far too low a level. Ray, right, let's explore on. Try and find some new areas to build cities because I do not have enough. It's already turn 31 and I only have the two towns nothing down there let's explore down here it, ooh, earth shot may as well build on that and as soon as that cleric's done I'm going to build another pioneer there would be a fantastic place for a fort not only will it block anyone coming up or there, it's nearish a river I don't think I'll be getting the bonus from the river if I build it there there's crystal crags or the iron I think iron's more important actually at the moment but I am worried about these guys Send him there. He's not going to be much a help around here. Let's see what's going on. Hear the lightning there? Ah! Alta! First enemy. Or oh, other, other channeler, as it were. Oh, he's got arches as well. May as well send him to explore over here, and him up here, I think, would probably be the best way. As much done as I possibly can. And there's that friggin' banshee. I can't do anything against that. And just an escape. Oh, and more iron. Gonna have to get an outpost there. And now I'll build a pioneer. I, I admit I am do have a bad habit of trying to rush build. I've trying to cut back on. That's why I've been building new towns far slower than I usually would. But hey, let's get back into the habit two more towns, one here that's only really good for a fort I suppose and up here would be absolutely excellent, lots of production right next to some iron and a crystal crag there in fact I can't think of anywhere better oh it's only, two. yeah that'd be best not only is it near a river, I don't think I'll get the improvements from that, but I'll get the crystal crag and also later on I'll be getting the iron and I'm not too close to those syndicate bastards either so I'll have time to build up to fight them Explore some more. I'm definitely looking forward to getting the crossbows because even though they do less attack, less attack than normal bows. Oh, he's right here. They do less attack than normal bows. They can hit multiple targets in a line, which sounds absolutely fantastic, if you ask me. Anyway. I 
I've not got much population there. Uh, ogres, I'm not going to try and mess with them just yet. Oh, but there is a quest right there. And more iron. Ah, oh, I'm going to have to build so many outposts around here. Let's try and see as much... Oh, he has got... He has got a pioneer around there. In Athica, I think that... that no, is that might be their capital? I don't think it is. Capitals have... I don't know. But if it is, and I built a big enough army, I could probably take that out. You go over here, and matey, explore a bit more up here. It's probably not wise. I probably should bring them back down here. And mining, just for that good old production. He's demanding 10 gold. I've got plenty of that. I can do a trade treaty. But now I'm especially keen to get a fortress here to help guard against him just in case of war. Because he has got mu much more power than me. He's likely to want to stop me. And also I heard diplomacy's changed so he might be a bit more aggressive. He might not be. Let's see what this quest is. Ah, find a random map to lead me to a cave. Find the wizard in the cave and save the princess. It's not find a wizard in the cave and save the princess, I just said it, but hey. Oh, oh no, you better not. You better not. Get there as fast as possible. I'm not going to surrender that to some bloody altar bastard oh. can I get another pioneer yes I can pioneer rush what's the other quest oh that's what I was doing my other hero Yeah, he's got the herbs. Oh, I probably should do that, shouldn't I? Well, that's a mistake on my part. And I hope that ogre does not attack. So I'll be screwed if he does. You go down there, help the old woman. And Pioneer's... Oh, only three more turns till I get there. Fantastic. There's no way he's going to get through that wood in time. It's as good as mine. And he's moved off. Why has he moved off? It's after that message. They move off now. Is that a new thing? Oh, that's, that's quite good, actually. A bit dangerous. Right, next turn. Oh, someone else. Remember. I have a feeling I'm going to have to do some early conquests if I want to expand any more than four towns, which I have no problem with. Just once soon as I get some iron, I'm going to stomp them into the ground. Well, that's the plan, anyway. As you can tell, I'm a very nice person.
reinforced chainmail, and he's only level one. But still, that is that's a good find this early on. My sovereign level five? No, he's not level five yet. But he will be. Explore up here because I don't want to be anywhere near that ogre. Let's see what goes on next turn. Oh, I'm more powerful than Umber. No, I'm not. Oh, why is the game frozen? Oh, it's the f it's a friggin' Drake, and he's got a horse. Joffrey chat. Whoa, no face there. That's a bug. But I'm not liking that Drake. He looks. He looks deadly. And also I need that town, because if if the game goes far on and they get a friggin' dragon, because that I will be bugged. And there's someone white there as well. And they're an empire by the looks of it. I've got loads of people near me. Lots of early conquests then. Hopefully, if it doesn't all go tits up. And now my new town. Let's call it something completely and utterly creative. North Fort. Oh yeah, my creativity exudes out of every orifice. black market plus one production I guess that's an empire building from the last one I've never had it before because I've never played empire before and also I should really be getting that grain to increase my growth so is there there's the monument I'll build that it's taking quite a while I should have I got a bell tower here no, but I can get a cleric and cre decrease my unrest and get some more fame. That sounds like a damn good idea. All right then, next turn. Oh, you want some money just for a bloody treaty? There you go. Okay. Ah, oh, it's Warlord Vega. His troops are a bastard to deal with. And he's got wargs. Yeah, I've heard there's a bug I've seen in the forums where enemies just completely ignore libraries. Which is a shame, because they're fantastic. And there's a place to build cities up here, unfortunately. There's kind of a big space in between them. So I won't be able to do that anytime soon. Let's see. Ooh, a curse scroll. Right then, let's give the old woman some herbs. Ah, uh, yeah, let's fight this guy. Whoa. Okay, I can defeat him. Go, go, gadget, go. There we go. He's dead. I think if you give it, if you give this potion to him, you get it from this quest, he actually follows you. Um, but I think it's better later on, just in case your heroes get damaged, you can just get rid of all their wounds. Oh, I like that one. String the bastard up. That's how real men do it. And if you disagree, then you're a dirty, dirty heretic. Okay, next turn. 
And let's see what's going on. Ah, next pioneer, gonna get my new town. That's probably gonna be a fort as well, because it's only actually got production. It's got nothing else, and it's on a wood. The only thing I'm scared against is to get near this banshee, which is a problem, because if that thing goes around, I can't hurt it. I will be screwed. Let's see, I do want to connect my towns up, so I may as well build a monument. And how much money am I making? I'm making loads of money. Oh, that's good. I don't need to get a merchant just yet. I can get a workshop. Increase my production. Sounds good. And Merchant Cross Bazaar, only 27 seasons. I'm getting that. I'm getting it. I don't care. I want that 10% to, to money, income, whatever it is. And there's nothing down there. Don't waste your time, mate. One thing that's quite bad at the moment about my position is I my guys haven't got much experience. Which is definitely a problem. One thing I'm going to have to do is get some troops, send them with this guy and just take out some of these ruffians down here. Let's see what equipment he's got. That is affected as initiative at all. Where is his initiative on here? I can't see it. That's a shame. I'll keep him leather because, uh, well, rusty stuff weighs a shit ton. It only gives you one extra bloody defense. Don't want to risk his initiative going down. Wolf Layer, I'll send him to. Let's see. How long will it be till I can get some decent units? Quite a bit. Six turns in that town that's newly built. In the other ones, six turns again. And four turns. Um, oh, I could get a defender. They're quite nice. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get a defender in, in there. Actually, no, he needs troops quickly, so I'll just get some spearmen to help him. Send him there for now. Has that changed hands? Oh no, they've made their first town a conclave. I never do that. Let's get the lost library. No! It's not like. Oh, damn. You're gonna have to go up there. Damn, I completely forgot I haven't got a hero with these guys anymore. They just wasted some of their own time. Damn. Is that Wildlands? It doesn't look like they're usually grey, but there looks like quite a lot of stuff in there. Caldera? I'm guessing that's a hint to Mountain Blade. A reference even, not a hint. Explore my minions. How much unrest have I got? Seven unrest. I'll lower it down by sending him in there. Oh, I've got, got so many things I need to build. It's ridiculous. Oh, I can build my new town though. Again, a completely and utterly constructive name. East Fort. Oh yeah. Because it's a fort, it's going to be a fort in the east. Build the basic bell tower and these other things. The probably best build the bell tower first, actually, because there's a load of unrest. But yeah, let's do that. It's only three turns, so I'll build that. Then the bell tower. Then the workshop. And then probably the monument, just to just to link it up to my main city. That's all. Low unrest even more. Now let's see what you could. What's that? Cragspawn. Don't think I want to mess with him just... No, I really don't want to mess with him. 56 health. Oh, and he's got a bear with him. Yeah, that doesn't look like it would be fun. Well, those guys are shooting ahead of me. I think I need to get some more military... I need to get weaponry as soon as possible. 
So the plan is, Umber's weak, get a small force and attack their city, take it over, get my fifth city like that, just like that, hopefully be a little bit stronger. Oh shit, I'm being attacked. He's going to die anyway, no matter what I do. And now he's going to miss him finger. One less accessory. Oh, that's... I've seen worse ones. But that was annoying. Bloody crag spawn. Who's he think he is? Killing my people. I need to get a monument there as well. Let's get that. That'll be out. That'll take a little bit longer to get there. And also make the syndicate start running around. So I'm going to start building. Need to build an outpost right here. And one right there to get this iron. Because that is pretty much essential to the war effort. Well, the war that will happen. And I don't want to go anywhere near that Drake. Go over there. Then up there. I don't know why Umber hasn't expanded. They just got all this right next to them. This, this would be a fantastic place for a city next to a river and five food. Why didn't they do it? Are they crazy? Are they insane? I just don't know. And they have a gold mine. Even more reason for me to invade them. They just look so juicy and tasty a target. Oh, still got one movement on them. I keep completely forgetting Mancers have uh, more movement, and there's a Wildlands. Ah, that could be why. Maybe there's Darkens going around, but then I, that's still not a good reason. I don't know why they haven't expanded. I really don't. What's those Pioneers doing? Don't say it's somewhere I can build there's probably somewhere I can build down here that I haven't seen yet. I really need to send more explorers down here, which is something I probably should do. In fact, I'm gonna send them down with him and after they take out these timber works. Oh, and there's a war glare there. Fantastic. That'll be the basis of my cavalry. Go there. Oh. Are they... Oh, you thrill. Whatever they're called. I thought they were wraith saying because they're pale as anything. There's not much up here. Let's go looking down there. I really want to rush those guys, but unfortunately I cannot. Why was me? And there's a crystal crag right there that I have not yet built on. Built on. Oh shit, there's a syndicate party right next to my town. Hopefully that they will take it out for me. Hopefully, I doubt it. But I hope. I do not want to be screwed this early on in the game because that will screw me for the entire game. Oh, they've expanded. Ah, oh, they've just expanded and it'll expand again unless when I got the monument built. That means they'll go walking around unless it's already expanded because the monument's about to be built but I don't think that's how it works. Oh dear. Maybe I have expanded too fast. Ah! Oh god, the Unbound. This is also a new thing with the legendary heroes. He's, uh... This guy, he's basically... I can't remember what they're called. The Juggernauts they are. And he's just this random strong one that wanders around the place and has a really big sword that you can kill him and get. Um, if you find him. I hope I don't find him this early on, I can tell you that. Because Juggernauts... The normal ones are beasts enough. He will eat me up and 
chew me out, chew me and throw me out. Let's get drills, plus one to army size, that's always useful. Oh, there's so many good, there's twilight bees here, that's bloody useful. Why have you not built a city here? Why? That's weak, get the refugee camp, new quest. I will end them. Yeah, I'm going to need reinforcements before I take that on. He's not going to be able to do it on himself. He's only like a level 3 hero. With some leather on. There's no one on that. Oh, I'm taking it. I'm taking it bad. You've got a city right next... There must be loads of badasses wandering around the place killing people. Well, I thought I was in a bad state. More iron. Gonna have to get that. I put. I thought I put low resources on this map, but it seems to be everywhere. Do I need to move? Ah, just some more spearmen. Send him on them. And let's go kill some wargs. Stab him in the face. Oh dear. Oh dear, dear me. This this is going far worse than I thought. I do not remember Wags being this strong. Or Spearman being that shit. Oh. Oh damn. Well, that was a massive failure. My excuse is it's been quite a while since I played this game. But that's obviously no excuse. Pine is he's gonna send a build city somewhere down there. My sovereign's incapacitated because he just got mullered like cream cheese. Ah, oh, this is bad. Right then, I need some proper troops. And for that I need some proper cities. With some proper tech. I've just got. Oh, him, yes. I suppose I can send him to help defend this city against the wandering syndicates. Or possibly against his wandering wargs, I don't know which will be worse. For now, I'll just send him to sit. to defend against the syndicates, because I know they are wandering, but wargs seem to be staying in one place. Which is strange. Anyway, let's go another turn, see what happens now. My towns are joined up. Fantastic. Let's see what's down here. And I go right next to a bear. Wonderful. This What? He's got friggin' horns! Friggin' horns! Cave bears don't usually have friggin' he's like a goat bear with tusks and horns and Ah! Oh! I, is that you? They look fantastic. Oh, you wonderful, wonderful beast, you. He's going to mull at me. I just know it. Get up. Oh, they're no longer there. Maybe they did kill the Syndicates. Oh, yeah, there's only one of her left now. The teammates have gone. They killed them. Thank you, strange lady. And Alta's power ratings just fell quite badly. Cool neutral. Why is he throwing... Oh, I am walking around in their territory. That's probably why. Well. So the plan now... Get some guys together, get a half decent army, take out that town, then maybe show the Al Altarians who's boss. And I want to know what is it with Stardock and calling people Altar? There's Altarians in in Buddy Galactic Civilizations too. There's Altarians here. Apparently, there's Altarians in a, which has nothing to do with a 
Star Dog. I'm guessing calling them Altarians is a reference to this in a Stargate or something. I don't know, I've never really seen much Stargate before. I've seen like one or two episodes. But, oh, and they just built an outpost there. How am I got how's my guy gonna get out? And he put what they built it next to a dragon. Or oh, Drake even. With lots of pack drakes. Oh, they're not gonna have a fun time. But he's got the dragon place. That means if they get high technology, which I hope they don't before me, and they get dancer dragons, I will be screwed. I'll be screwed into the earth. But I'm gonna try and oh I can't Yeah, I'm gonna have to get out the long way. Oh that's deadly. Oh and he's right there. This poor hero, he's not gonna have a good time. And with his purple hair and Yeah, he's got purple hair, he's surrounded by monsters, he can't escape this way, there's a Drake there, a bloody fired lord there. And purple hair. Poor man. Very, very poor man. I would not want to be him. I would not want to be in his shoes. They're very horrid, soggy, purple, drakey shoes. Now go here and protect your capital city from Wags, boy. Oh, why am I not building more troops? I need, I need decent troops. Ones that don't die in one turn against Wags would be ideal. Right, let's go for another turn. Oh, and they're right in the way. Damn wargs. Get in there. Good boy. Two more seasons immobilized and ten seasons so I have reinforcements. Go up here, get ready to reinforce this dude. Yeah, go right there. Fantastic. Oh, I can't wait till I have some decent troops, a decent army, and I can start showing these guys who's boss. And if I go here and get the fame, eight Gildar, and and there's no wargs there. I was under the impression, the wrong impression apparently, I would be able to train wargs there. Well, I am incredibly disappointed. That's not good. Wow, look at him in his red coat, doesn't he look snazzy? Mounted warfare, yes, get mounted warfare. I want to get my heroes on horses, make them good. Oh no, on horses, more like wargs. Make them useful. Get down here, boy. They can just wait from there. I don't want them to go close to the scales, scaths, even. I don't want them to get attacked and destroyed. Has that gone down a turn from how much it needs? I bloody hope so. Let's get the monument there and all the good stuff. Oh, I didn't get a lumber yard. Fantastic. Make production even better. Make myself be able to troop, build troops faster. I don't really care about the quality. I just want half-decent troops in leather armour. Because I, I like guys in leather, you know. I'm not homosexual, but... I think they look snazzy. It looks kind of Roman, I think, on this game, the leather armour. And they can just guard there. Please don't attack me, Scaths. Get down there. I should I should have probably waited, but I'm getting impatient. Oh, whoa, and the, the drakes have destroyed their outpost. They did not think that through, did they? Well, at least they'll be able to get the Darkened Cave before them, maybe get the fame, maybe i get something else instead of just unlocking a Dragon's Cave or whatever it's called. Anyway, let's go on. 
anyway, I think that oh, Knights of Cal Calder. Wow, I guess that's uh, just a unit. Oh, wild riding's a different one. I forgot that. Archery's more important than wild riding, unfortunately. But yeah, so I think that's been over half an hour. That's this video over and done with. At the oh, trade proposal, and they're offering me money. Fantastic! I'll take that. So it used to be demanding it, now you're offering it. Ha 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 ha. Anyway, I think that's going to be the end of the video now. As I said at the beginning, I'm going to try and get a video of Fallen Enchantress every other day. And hopefully in the next videos, it'll be a little bit more interesting because I'll be taking cities, not just building up and making my small little empire here. Anyway, for now, ta -ra!